All right, guys, fitness guru Jim, pride of the north, north here. And um, what I'm going to be doing today is answering your emails, Facebook messages, Twitter messages, just offering you a bit of an insight into fitness. You know, questions that I'm regularly asked, such as uh, what do you prefer training with, Jim? Free weights or machines? You know, personally, I only train free weights. I don't trust machines. I've seen the Terminator, and I know about Skynet. So, and um, just myself personally, just back from the gym, had a workout, and if everybody knows. As soon as you finish your workout, it's important to restock your protein. You have a wee 20-minute window when you finish training called the circle of life, and it's important to get your protein replenished in that circle of life period. So what I'm going to do here is uh, just get the best protein known to man on board, which everybody knows automatically is bovine booby juice. Nothing like the milk of the gods. Delicious and nutritious. So good every time. Let's get going. Jim. When you aren't training, do you like to travel? Um, like when I'm not uh, training myself or people in the gym, I love the opportunity to travel. But uh, you know, it's difficult nowadays to get on airplanes when you're carrying heavy artillery like this. You know, guns. You know, guns in the sun. Or not my case, because obviously you can't bring a sort of weaponry on a plane. A recent study has suggested that there's a link between eating red meat and cancer. Do you believe this? I could well believe it actually, um, you know, if you want to get cancer, go ahead and eat all the red meat you like, but if you're smart and you're looking gains, be like Jim, make sure you cook your red meat until it's brown before you eat it, and then you'll be fine. What's your record deadlift? Um, my record deadlift is, I think it's 480, um, you know, that's with no, no straps, no gloves, uh, just bareback, because, you know, Jim always goes bareback when he's going hard at it. Um, so I four four eighty. What would you say is the best type of cardio? Best type of cardio I would say would be walking, uh, walking yourself to the squat rack, stacking the bar, and doing a real man's exercise. That's the best type of cardio, mate. Uh, Jim, you said that your record deadlift is four hundred and eighty kilos. Uh, when the world record is actually measured at four hundred and sixty three kilos. Uh, well, you're wrong, actually, mate. The world record's in pounds. You know, pounds are are actually heavier than kilos. P after K in the uh, alphabet, mate. So get your facts right before you try and mug me off, Joker. What What do you think of CrossFit? I've never actually heard of CrossFit, but I assume it's probably just when you train, you look cross, like if you were lifting a, lifting a heavy dumbbell, and all of a sudden you're like looking raging, like you're lifting a bar, you're oh, oh, near <laughs> myself. <laughs> oh, bollocks, Gina. Stick immersion on, please. Jim, who would you say is your fitness idol? Well, that's a tough one. There are so many people that have inspired me to the greatness that I am today. A um, couple of honorary mentions. First of all, Mr. Motivator, um, Davy Hasselhoff and his trunks, and uh, lastly, Hulk. Hogan. Nah, mate, the incredible. Uh, mm. My number one fitness idol is WWE wrestler Triple H. Um, you know, there's a very similar path walk between myself and Triple H, you know, he's managing a business, I'm managing a business, and sometimes you have to cross that line from professional business owner and active competitor, you know, Triple H sometimes just try to be overthrown by some of the wrestlers, but, you know, Triple H just has to drop them with a the pedigree, same as me, you know, if my employees get out of hand, I just drop them with a the pedigree, just actually asked ask Tracy last week, asked for a pay rise, don't think so, you know, hopefully, you will know, get better soon, soon Tracy, and I'll see you on the gym floor. Jim, you're you're in the fitness. How about fitness, Dick? And your and then you have a ballet too. Who the dirty oh, dirty B? Fucking see these dirty B's. So that's enough. I'm not answering any more of these. Dirty.